what I was proud of for sure is how hard we played the whole game. I thought our, I thought defensively we were pretty good. And I don't nobody stopping King so far, so we'll have to see if we were average or not because he's pretty good. Um, but mostly to take their run and and all all the excitement that they had going for them uh, on the timeout we called and to come back out and maintain our poise. We got a nice little lob play to, to sort of quieten the crowd down and then got stops and scores and took the game back over. That's not easy to do. You know, the same as Monday, we just wanted to come out and, and uh, play better, you know, challenge ourselves to play better, um, execute better offensively. And it was the same kind of thing. You know, our defense just kind of carried us through, uh, in this, especially in the second half. We knew we had to buckle down and um, proud of the way our guys uh, fought. F, you know, playing a lot of these games back to back, it seems like in um, not a lot of time to prepare for a really good MTSU team who's going to be, they're going to be a tournament team again this year too. So just really proud of our guys. All we talked about all week was how good middle or all preparation. We haven't had a week. We haven't had any time to prepare for anybody yet and still don't for the next two days. But just talked about how tough they were and how, how smart they played and how much they did what their coach wants them to do and that we couldn't afford mistakes. And so we didn't, we didn't talk a lot about we talk, actually, middle's so good, we talked it was a, about it was a chance to get a quality win. Especially on the road when the crowd gets going like that, that's kind of where in the past, you know, we, we would collapse. You know, any team, any good team can collapse in that situation. But, you know, we thought we felt like we were defending well. You know, we were just we were just kind of giving them run outs on the offensive end, turning the ball over, and that's how they, that's how they got their run. So uh, some of our best defense tonight was just executing better on offense and taking care of the ball. So I thought we did a better job of that in the last four minutes of the game uh, to seal it. We didn't do anything different. We did, we did switch to a zone and got one stop in it, but then they scored against it the next time when we got out of it. We just wanted to change their rhythm a little bit. That's really all we did in terms of strategy or changing what we were doing. I, th I thought our plan was good. They run a lot of different things on offense and execute them very well. Uh, and you know, I'm sure that he didn't. They did, I'm sure they're upset they didn't knock down more threes. They're five for 17. That's a plus for us. Uh, and but but I thought we did a good job on pretty much everybody. Giddy Potts. That's probably as good as we can do against him. I think for a young team like us, it's really good. Um, it kind of shows us uh, the fruits of our labor, everything we've been building uh, once we, the first day of practice to now. Um, and a lot of times, it can give a team like us some confidence. You know, knowing our ceiling, like knowing what we're capable of and that we can still play better than we have, you know. So I think it's definitely a huge confidence boost to, to get these wins early. Um, and we're just we're just having fun with it, you know. We're just, you know, on to the next one kind of thing. You know, we don't fear anybody. We respect everybody. And I think we showed that tonight. A lot of toughness on our, on our end.